With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Construct the following angles at the initial point of a given ray and then justify the construction. The angles that we have to make is are 45 degrees and 90 degrees. So we will first make our uh, ray and then we will start with the construction of the angles. Let's call this ray O A. Then we will first make our 90 degree angle and then we will bisect that to get our 45 degree angle. So to make a 90 degree angle we will use a compass and take a random distance on the compass like this. Then we will place our compass on O and make a semicircular arc. Once we have done that, we will make two more arcs by placing our uh, compass with the same distance on it on this point. So first let, uh, name this point as B. We'll place it on B and we'll make two more consecutive arcs like this. Let's name them C, D. Now what this point C, D signify is if we join point C, O, A then the angle that is the angle C, O, A will be 60 degrees and angle D, O, A will be 120 degrees. So to construct an angle of 90 degrees we will have to somewhat make a, a bisector of this angle which is angle DOC. So to do that we again get our compass take the same distance on the compass throughout the sum we are not going to change the distance on the compass. So we, now we place the compass on C make an arc and again we place the compass on D make another arc and finally we join these points which is 90 degrees so we have and let's name this E so we have made angle E O A which is 90 degrees and now since we have made this angle 90 degree angle we can bisect it to get our 45 degree angle so to bisect it we use our compass and we keep the distance same place it on O and make two arcs which is which are these points these intersection points on both the sides which is OE and OA so next we place our uh, compass on B make an arc place the compass on this point which is the point of intersection of side o, EO and the semicircular arc and make one more arc now we see that both of these arcs intersect. So we'll join this point of intersection with point O to get our angle bisector of uh, our right angle EOA. Let's name that, uh, name this F. So angle F OA is half of angle EOA equal to 45 degrees. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.